What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of The Good Boys, hosted yeah. by The Hustle House. I'm yeah. Tucker Janal. Carson Janal. I'm Sean Shutt. Parker Paul Hill. Uh, Nash with The Flash. This is our first episode back after like two weeks. We had been filming a bunch of these, and they just weren't hidden. Yeah, so, now, we got, yeah. now we got a couple up right now. Yeah. We got yeah. a couple live. Yeah, we got some good responses from it. I Friends, would say family. They, they were hitting. They were yeah. hitting. Just only the like... first couple? We, yeah, no, no, like two... How many have we recorded now? Probably six. Yeah, we I think the like last one we these. were just way too hungover. So yeah, yeah, last week was rough. Yeah, or two weeks ago. I no, guess. that was because of the fourth. It was the day mm, after. Yeah, but yeah, I feel like we got a good flow now. Things are going. We got good responses from the first two episodes. Yeah, great responses. Yeah. Friends, friends, family hit me up. They're like, dude, I love this kind of content. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we didn't expect it. Like we, we appreciate y'all listening. Yeah, yeah. appreciate. Cool. Yeah. Appreciate all y'all for sure. And especially, like, friends, like you said, like, yeah. it's cool. Like, I had some friends reach out to me, like, that are listening in. Like, uh, it's just, like, usually some of the stuff we do, it's not yeah, stuff yeah. they would like. Yeah. So, like, it's for them to, up. like, tune into stuff that I'm making, it's pretty dope. Yeah. I was telling Nash, I think it's, like, it's super relatable for them to, like, listen to us because they know us from home. Mm -hmm. And, like, we're still the same people, but we don't, like, keep up with them all the time, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, they don't know what goes on every week. Yeah. But then they get to hear it, and they're like... Yeah. Oh, yeah, I could totally see those guys. They had to sneak into a party. That's something they would totally be doing anyways. Yeah. Sean jumping fences. Yeah, literally. So. <laughs> yeah, no, it's because people hit me up, too, and saying, like, yo, I actually like your podcast. So I was just like, yeah. Yeah. good oh, yeah. responses. Like, people that I wouldn't think that I would hear from, that they're like, yo, I actually really fuck with it. I just think it's because we keep it keep it real. Yeah, yeah. no, definitely. They never text me about my thirst trap TikTok, so <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know it's good, bro. <laughs> Yeah, words out now that I'm broke, so <laughs> <laughs> it is what it is. A decent amount of people have asked us to harp on at, in the podcast how we all met, and um, I mean it's a question that uh, we get asked a lot, and mm -hmm. it's kind of a it's it's a it's a it's a weird little story. Yeah, navigating. So obviously, Tucker and Carson have known each other since birth. <laughs> yep. Um, they're brothers. And me <laughs> if and, you didn't know. Yeah. Surprise. 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 <laughs> um, me and Parker met probably in seventh. I started going to the same school as him in seventh grade. We started being friends probably like freshman year of high school. Yeah. And then, yeah, Tucker and Carson, or pfft, Tucker and Parker went to college together, Furman yep. University. F you. Yep. Um, <laughs> And then we all kind of just like, you were already living out here in LA. Me and Parker made our way out to yeah. LA. And I think you, one of you two reached out to the other one and we're like, yo, let's start hanging out. Like mm -hmm. mutual or whatever. Like we're friends out here. East no, Coast no. dudes. The, the way it happened was I went to Coachella like two years ago and I go, I DM Parker and I was like, bro, you got to be performing at, at Coachella. <laughs> <laughs> That's and, hilarious. And that was it. And then like we started hanging out a little bit. And then quarantine hit. Me and Cars went back home to Hilton Head. And then we moved out here together. And then oh, I forgot that that you yeah, left I for a little bit. I left for like three months. Wow, I wow. forgot about that. Yeah, we were still out here. I was working. Uh, I was working for BMW, big photographer over there, <laughs> yeah. big guy. Let's you go. know. <laughs> but yeah, so when we went back home is when like me and Carson started doing like TikTok and stuff oh, like wow. with, our, with our other brother. Hmm. And then so we decided to move out here. We were hanging out again, like us, us yeah, four. Yep. Yeah. And then our lease was ending. Y'all's was ending around the same time, and yep. I was like, I was like, we we had started helping this one other house like get started and like giving yeah, them advice and stuff. Them. Yeah. So we, yeah, we I was saw like, how it worked with them it, and it worked bit, so it worked stuff. great for them. So I was like, I was like, boys, we should start one. Like we should start our own creator house. Like it's it could be different because like we're all doing different stuff in entertainment. Like I was doing acting before social media. Yeah, Carson was trying to get into acting and modeling and stuff. And you're doing music, Nash yeah. is doing video videography work. I was like, dude, we'd be a perfect group. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it made and a then, lot of sense. And then, and, yeah. And then we recruited five star recruit, Sean Schutt. Well, yeah. Well, yeah, we, <laughs> me, me and Carson like made TikToks. We were like, hey, start a new creator house. Let us know if you want to join. We had a ton of people like hitting us up about it. Everyone I'd like talk to, I'd, I'd be like on the phone with them and they're like, oh, so like, what am, what am I going to have to do? Like, what do I, like, what do you need from me? Like, how many posts? And like, asking all this, I call Sean literally the first day. He goes, what's up like I, <laughs> like I literally hadn't even given him the yes like you're in it he's like I can't fucking wait dude. <laughs> he's like I got so many good ideas and I was just like dude this guy is awesome and then yeah, yeah like people don't understand like we've met like seven months ago like yeah because we're like 
everyone's the best of friends. Yeah. yeah. And it's like, yeah. I mean, when you live with somebody for seven months straight, you get to know yeah. them real quick. I mean, yeah, yeah we've been spending, not even just living, like, we just do everything together yeah. for the yeah. most part. I mean, some of us will go off on, like, a little trip here or there or whatever, do, like, a little job, but, like, for the most part, we're spending, like, every second of every day with mm -hmm. each other. So, yeah, you get close pretty quick, but... It's been a crazy ride. I mean, five star number one recruit out of North Carolina. I mean, mm -hmm. dude, I couldn't <laughs> wait to get the fuck out of there. Like, I, if I had the, I had that one opportunity, and I was like, I cannot blow it. Like, if I can get in there, like, I'm leaving. Like, because yeah. I knew, like, just like that small town vibes. Like, if you don't leave in a certain amount of time, that's where you're gonna live forever. For and sure. I was like so scared of that. Like, I was like, I need to go experience stuff, and that's like why I kind of started like social media, TikTok, like, cause I thought this, like, I can make this happen. Mm -hmm. yeah. Here I am, motherfuckers. <laughs> like, yeah. But, yeah. But, but yeah, no, it's been sick. Like these guys pretty much changed my life since, cause I was able to come out here and live with them and best friends now. Like, yeah. yeah. Carson, friends. Carson's the one who like found you though, like yeah. off your drinking videos and he was showing, do you remember like sitting up in the apartment? I was like showing you all his videos and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. I remember. I remember seeing the vids. Yep. Yeah, now we out here. I mean, yeah, so that's pretty much... Nash I mean, and I didn't even talk to him ever until he was like, we were bro, roommates. I, like, yeah. hey, we're roommates. Yeah, because <laughs> you guys picked him up from the airport. Yeah. And I remember like, we just We were like, still checking into the house and yeah, stuff. Yeah. And I literally never even talked to him or anything. Like, or even like, I wasn't even on TikTok yet. I made a TikTok probably like the day we moved into the house or something. Literally, like, both of us. Yeah. So I knew nothing. And I wasn't just like... I wasn't in on the social media world on Instagram or anything like that, so I literally had no idea. And then, like, he's in the house. I'm like, oh, I guess I'm living it's with this guy. It's a good guy. Good guy we got. I, when they picked me up from the airport, I was like, I was still like pretty nervous. I'm like, I just moved across like country. Yeah, yeah. Like, alone. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, a bunch pretty, of dudes. Like, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, a little nervous. They're like, yo, yo. I go to open up the trunk and it just smeared off. Oh and yeah, like, we get iced. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, no way. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, and that's what started the journey right there. Yeah. <laughs> <Get pranked. laughs> so yeah, that was, that was so funny to me. And then that's the night that we all got the margaritas. It's my birthday. Yeah. Oh yeah, literally Tucker's yeah. birthday, first day we moved into yeah. the house. Yeah. The funniest thing to me was like, we obviously got the house on Airbnb, and like the rules on like I think we noticed the rules like day of or something, and they're like no parties, but like. This was no still outside. Corona, too. Yeah, fresh, like, last November. Yeah. Fresh Rona. Not that fresh, but it was heat <laughs> still, of it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and, yeah, it was, like, no parties, blah, blah, blah. It was, like, oh, damn, like, this is a sick house, but are we going to be able to have fun in it? You guys pull up, and, like, the owner's, like... Making us rip shots. Shots. Bro. Let's yeah. go. Like, yeah. Rudy. He's like, how many... Boy Rudy. Rudy's the man. He yeah. was trying to stay around and drink with us, dude. Like, literally waiting for y'all to get there. He's like, oh, we, we could just hang out, man. Yeah. He was but, like, you guys got to throw the fattest parties. Yeah. <laughs> and like, we're like, oh, bet. We thought <laughs> that sign. Dude, no, Rudy, we were good. From when you guys first met him, you guys took shots. And then when we all left, we took, we shots. took shots. Like, Rudy's the man. He like, the table, bro. He's the man. Fuck, yeah. my bad. I need to stop with that. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, I remember that we were all pretty down bad the day that we left. It was the last night of the house, and we obviously went crazy. Yeah, and you, and oh I remember you yacked after taking Bro, a shot. Bro, he was, so like, he heard we loved Tito's, and he was like, oh, I got just what you guys need, especially hungover, like, this guy probably rips one of these every morning. Yeah. I wouldn't be surprised. That had a Viagra. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we love Rudy, though, but he, he literally was like, I got what you guys need, it keeps me, uh, I, I don't get sick or anything. And I'm oh, feeling yeah, it's like, like good for your immune system yeah, or something. He like, like ginger a, and like vodka. And yeah, he made some it. Russian thing. Yeah, some olives and all this shit. Like, yeah. Um, but I took it and literally like right when I it went down, I was like, that's not good, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that's, about 20 minutes later, I go downstairs to the, the bathroom. That was the last thing I did. That, that was my bathroom. Yacked it up in there. <laughs> the last thing you did in that bathroom. <laughs> literally. Left this mark, bro. Classic. Yeah. So I, I miss that house. Yeah. Good memories in there for Great sure. Great memories. Yeah, I mean, good vibes all around. It was just, I don't know. I And then that was like, there was like such a big gap between there. Like, I just feel like that month is so separated from like the rest of the stuff we've done. Because like, since we've moved back out here, we've just been out here like the whole time. Yeah. We did that like first month and then we like all went home for Christmas. Yeah. Well, I know we went to Tahoe, but like, yeah, yeah, yeah. that was like a goodbye almost kind of thing. 
So like, yeah, I just feel like month one is just like different. Not yeah, it was different for yet. sure. Every month is different. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> Every day. <laughs> but um, so how's everyone's week? Or really? two weeks, I guess, since we got a lot to catch up on. Yeah. yeah. Should we tell them about Fourth of July? Because we never got that one out. Yeah, we never got that one. <laughs> yeah. 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 I mean, we had a little Fourth of July fiasco at uh at our house. Great spot for it. Um, mm -hmm. And we invited a bunch of people over. I mean, how we... many people do you think were there? 100, easily 150. 100. Yeah, easily 100. Dude, at the peak yeah. towards the end, I we were probably like before it got all shut down, like. We were probably pit pushing like 150, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and we had. I mean, Bryce pulled up. Yeah. Nate, Nate pulled up. Like, Ryland, Barry. Yeah, dude, we had, a, we had a great, we had a great group. The group coming. unexpected kids came. Yeah. Yeah. They were. They got there right before it all got shut down, so they like mm. saw it as like, "Fuck this!" Like, mm. it's all right, it happens. They saw it all unfold. Yeah, it yeah. shut down at like eight o'clock, but up until then, was it nine maybe? No, it was still kind of like daylight. Right See, day, honestly, yeah. though, blessing in disguise because then we ended up going to Tannis. Yeah. yeah. That that was a dope because, party. Because, yeah. because if like if the party didn't get shut down, we probably would have stayed there too long, and then we would have tried to get into Tannis, and then we all know how that was going. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was a shit show, trying to get Dude, in. Dude, yeah, David Dobrik was literally kicking people out Like when he was leaving. He's like, that's it, guys. Party is wrapped. <laughs> like, David Dobrik is no, yeah, kicking people I out. I will say... First time I saw Good him, kind of crazy. Yeah, <laughs> like just walk. I mean, I didn't like say what's up to him. Yeah, we don't know him, but like we were first there. time to just saw him in person, though. Weren't, weren't you like I saw him at the bathroom? I swear, dude, I dapped him up. Dude, I have a <laughs> faint memory of just like seeing him and just like going for the dap and then like just walked off. It was cool though. Probably never remember me ever again. But <laughs> Tessa will. Dude, don't say ever again. Yeah. Oh yeah, Tessa will remember you. You were making those, making the eye contact Dude. from across the room. We've seen her again since then, and no, I was, I was wrong. <laughs> I was probably wrong. There's still a chance. Uh, you might, it might have been a. Dude, we'll see. Place and time. You'll you know? be good. You'll be good. Man, but yeah, but, yeah. Our yeah, party ended up getting shut down, so mm. kind of sucked. But it then worked we got out to go, for the yeah. best, though. Like I mm -hmm. think that's how we planned it. Like originally and then we all got really drunk but that's how we wanted it to have yeah. people over and Did then go, go to somewhere. tana's yeah. yeah so i think it worked out for the best well, yeah this fourth was weird like nobody had plans like leading up to it yeah like everyone's like what's going on today like and we just happened to be like yo come over let's run it it was dope fun while it lasted <laughs> haven't had many parties since yeah we hosted our um event oh. our first event on friday shout out to anyone who came yeah yeah that was sick yeah. it was crazy sean was crowd surfing <laughs> yeah the crowd was no, wild not, not really i was <laughs> crowd surfing. i was uh there was a crowd was and you were you were surfing. surfing i felt like the fucking man at the time because <laughs> i was literally just up in the air and then i looked back at the video that someone took and it was just Tucker Carson and Parker, <laughs> and there was up. one other guy. No, no, there's yeah, one there was one random guy. Yeah, yeah, one guy. Random guy. yeah. yeah. <laughs> he was like, yeah. Shout out to that and guy, like, bro. I look. It's the video is so funny, but it's it's the just one of the videos them. you can't even tell. Yeah, it's, one of the one it of just looks like you're surfing. Yeah, dude, one of the videos. It's so funny. It's just yeah. like Tucker and <laughs> Carson, <laughs> just like it. right down there, and they're just like, "Yeah, come on, come on!" Whoever, and then he yeah. jumps just on to like just them two. <laughs> Whoever <laughs> filmed it literally did a zoom in on just them, and then to me, and then me jumping onto them. I was like, "Damn, dude!" And <laughs> Parker went right before you, but just nobody was ready with the cameras. Yeah, and nobody <laughs> caught me very well. <laughs> <laughs> he jumped. He jumped face first. Yeah, there's a video, dude. I, and like yeah. literally, he's flipping over me, about to land on his head. Feet were above the head at one yeah. point. It was not good. At first, when we were, it there, evolved from us jumping from the second story. I was story. Just about to say, you yeah. were gonna do that. I went up there, bro, and I was looking at it, and like. I was like, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna jump. <laughs> and, then, and then this guy was like, bro, you probably shouldn't jump. <laughs> what like, are you, yeah, Travis Scott out here, that's bro? That's what, just... exactly what was on my mind, bro. Yeah. Travis got people jumping. It wasn't that high, though. Save it was it. one story. Save it for Saturday. Dude, Save I'm not, Saturday. I've decided Travis. it's probably not a good idea to jump off uh, no, I, multiple stories of anything. I remember you came up to me, and that's when I knew you were so drunk. But I looked at you, I was like, we're doing it. Once you, yeah, you, you were put, down. Yeah, you put the idea in my head. I was like, let's do, do it. I went up there, too, and same thing. I was just like, I'm, I think I'm going to jump from up here. And this guy was like, yeah, probably not best best idea. So we just jumped off a railing. Still felt Still really sick. lick. I yeah. will say, 
it should be inspiring to all y'all out there. You don't need to be a rapper or anyone crazy to crowd surf. You just need a couple <laughs> of friends. <your> buddies. <laughs> Make sure they're pretty like bigger than you though. Honestly. Yeah. Like, don't have <laughs> don't have your biggest friend jump into your like the smallest see, friend's hands. See, yeah. am I am I gonna get a chance to do that? I was just about to say yeah, I Carson. think it would be different. Yeah, I wanna go. If Carson <laughs> jumps out there, we probably all four. All hands on ready. deck. Yeah, yeah okay. for sure. Easy bitty with us too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Maybe a couple more from we'll, we'll recruit a couple people also. <laughs> Dang, well, yeah, we've we've had two events now that we've like promoted and hosted. The second one was way different than that one. A yeah. joke? Yeah. It was a joke, yeah. Second one, we couldn't even get all of our people in. Yeah. I'm I mean, sorry. We, yeah, we, that was bad, we tripled dude. the size and venue. We had a bunch of people come in. Dude, dude our it. guest well, list yeah. was literally, I took a video of it, was like over 200 people. Oh my god, we blew it. Well, it had no, to be 1,200 venue. We, that's what we were supposed no, to do. No, yeah, that's yeah. literally the whole, yeah, that was the whole reason we were getting paid. So we, like, plus the, uh, like, the that was just, like, the VIP list. Yeah. But yeah. then, I mean, like, we just had, like, and some. all of our people showed up, and they couldn't get in. Yeah. yeah Lots of apology detrimental. texts going out the next day. Yeah, for sure. We're sorry if you were there and didn't get in. <laughs> <laughs> it was just nah. ridiculous. Like, I don't understand why they asked us to put together a list like that. Yeah. yeah. Then, like, if we are down there, we're hosting an event, and we're like, yo. He, uh, it was literally Johnny, Nate, and yeah, Berkeley. I was like, those three. Just get those three in. And he was like, I don't care. Like, it's just like, yeah. bro, you should. You should. Like, yeah. this is this is your venue. You like, want to fill it out this or event. What? We yeah. should have called This is what guy. we're here to do. What are we? What? Are, what do you? Mean? We should have called that guy's bluff. He was not the owner. Fucking bastard. <laughs> I talked to a bunch of people, man. Dude, yeah, we. Mm. Yeah. There was no point in arguing with any of them. Yeah. So we ended up really just leaving. Yeah. I'm sure the event did sell out though. It it it, it looked kind of dope after we left. Okay, but, but we were in like. No, they we didn't really. give us our fucking VIP section. Dude, the VIP section was a joke. It was literally yeah. a bench. And like, they didn't give us our bottles. Yeah. <laughs> So what were we doing? <laughs> we were paying for drinks at the bar. We were just another fucking... Yeah. And the, th the yeah. section really, like, that was, like, the killer right there. It's like, so there was a lot of issues. Any point. There was a yeah. lot of issues getting in, and then once we did get in, the one section that we were supposed to have, like, just random people in there were just, like... Right. Yeah. And, like, there was no one there for us to go to and be like, hey, can you get them out of this section? So we're not just going to be going up to random people and just yeah. be like, yo, get out of there. <laughs> like, yeah. it's not out of my section. <laughs> yeah, I'm just not doing that. Not Dude, the, that guy. the one good thing that did come out of it, though, the bracelets. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Yeah, we're all rocking them. I haven't taken mine wow. off, literally. I almost are wearing it. That's she, lit. Made, she made the Look, good boys. we got a little oh, wait. good cam. boys, whichever cam Sebastian uses. <laughs> yeah. Dude, yeah, no, these good are boys. Some sick. Fan made them for us. Dude, I wish that was huge. I'm so bad at names, but I wish I remembered her name. Me I, too. I have. I was looking to see if she tagged right, me. Alright, so anything. we were really lit, and I'm I'm gonna apologize like five times ahead of time because I I feel bad that we didn't get her name I right. Know. But I think uh, it was either Isabella damn. or Isabel or like Alisa or something like that. Mm. I could be wrong. I feel if, like Isabel. I feel like that's right. If you if you're listening in on this, we're sorry, Isabel or Elisa, or if that's not your name at all, we're so sorry. Hey, well, but, but reach, ta reach out, us. Yeah, reach out. out to us. We'll see it. Yeah, and yeah. We'll, I took a Snapchat video with her. I was like, her. oh, she made me a brace. Yeah, you got that video with her. That was it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But um, yeah, that's my new thing. Is now like when fans come up, not, not supporters come up and ask me for a picture. It's okay to have I, fans, man. I take pictures with them now too on my phone. Because mm. it's fun. Yeah, I'm, I want to remember this shit. <laughs> <Is it? laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a fire. Yeah, like, like I'm just gonna like, <laughs> I have a bunch. Every now. time they ask for a picture, you ask for one. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, it's my new thing. That's cool. I will say we went to uh, we went to Melrose yesterday, me and Sean. Yep. And Sean has been down about just. We've all been down about the views and whatever. Yeah, TikTok's yeah, yeah. We're not down been, bad right now. Yeah, yeah, just everything's not great. And really, we were getting a lot of love. Like, I mean, not me that much, but Sean <laughs> no, was getting you, a lot you of did. love. You told Someone me. did recognize me, actually. Hey. And, and then... And the girl that asked for your snap. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Asked yeah. Him. Yeah, one of, one of Sean's fans. <laughs> okay. <There's> still. <laughs> still. It's I wasn't it's there good. when she asked for it. <laughs> it's good. It's but, good. <laughs> yeah, lots like... Of, lots of love, yeah. That, that was great for me, honestly. <laughs> I needed it so bad, because I was so down bad, and, like... 
went to Melrose just to like go out like for yeah. the day, go outside, get some fresh air, enjoy the, enjoy my day. But I took like I had a lot of people come up to me, tell me how much they love my videos. Like it made me feel a lot better because like right before I left, you guys remember I was saying like I feel like people in the TikTok community, everyone knows who we are, but like numbers wise, sometimes yeah. it doesn't show. And then going there like and getting a bunch of love was. Just yeah, dude, the encouragement is always helpful. Yeah. It's yeah. stressful. Yeah, they, we, uh, we saw Frankie and Asaf too, or not hey. Asaf, uh, Jericho. Yeah. And, um, they, they said they listened into, I, like, when they what said up, that, boys? I was like, <laughs> yeah. I was like, damn. Listening again. What I was up, like, boys? damn, they listen, like, that's lit. And they yeah. said they loved it. So, I mean, Hell yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. You guys giving us the love, it does help because sometimes we question, yeah. like, what are we doing out here? <laughs> so I mean, know, the numbers the numbers haven't up. been great lately for us, and like, I know we shouldn't We've be looking at them that much. Ad heavy, bro. I know, but we did we did put out a video recently on YouTube when the Avengers, if they were in college, and dude, oh yeah, we were so hyped about it. We and thought it, just, it was hilarious, man. Yeah, we thought this we is gonna thought be it was our thing. big break. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be a this is gonna be our thing doing skits, funny skits, <clears throat> and. Uh, I don't know. We were it's predicting. Okay. We were like hundred k views for sure. First week. <laughs> it's like it's got what, like. Don't you have to do something because that didn't happen? That was another one, bro. Oh. That was the tick. That was the swimming TikTok. I said if it hits twenty million. Twenty. Yeah. Yeah. What was I thinking? We never had a video hit twenty. <sighs> Yeah, it's I, have take, I have to take two. Uh, <laughs> I have to take two beatboxes to the face. Yeah, he's we. He's, 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 wow, someone said we've never had a twenty mil video, and he goes, "I know it was bound to happen. We're, <laughs> we're, we're due. due. We're due. One. <laughs> we're due for one." Jeez. Yeah, I don't know if we're due, but, but no. But I feel like I've heard that a lot with like friends that I've met in TikTok. Like it's really hard. People focus on like numbers, and it's hard not to when this is what we're out here for. Yeah. But it's just like. I don't know, like, it's cr it's crazy to say, like, how much we care about views on a social media yeah. app, but that's, like, yeah, we're how we make our... We're approaching it with a business mindset a little bit, you know, yeah. like, we're trying to make this work and monetize it. You gotta, you gotta get views, <laughs> you, know to, you gotta get views to make money. I facts. mean, mm -hmm. facts. It is what it is, like, I mean, we don't want to get hung up in it too much and, like... You know, get us down. Do anything for the views or whatever it is. We still want to stay true to what we're trying to do, but yeah, yeah. like we need. The but money. it's hard sometimes. <laughs> it's hard. Yeah. So yeah. we're trying to. We've been trying to think outside the box, and that's where we got the like the Avengers mm -hmm. idea. We wanted to try something new, and I feel like it didn't do as well as we wanted it to, at all. So like we were like very down about it, but I think that we just need to keep doing. That's what we're gonna do. All right, like there might be some off the walls ideas coming your way. Yeah, yeah. but they're gonna be entertaining at minimum. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no. And then that night we went to Jordy's uh, B day party at, oh, yeah. at Boa. Oh, yeah. oh, the Boa. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> shout out to to Jim Harris first off for uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jim Harris. Jim Harris for this meal. Yeah. <laughs> is, is she the is she the mayor of the of Con? I this think week? So. I think so. I think so, too. 100%. All right, let's just go ahead and announce it. Go ahead. Tell the story, bro. All right, so we're at uh, our friend Jordy's birthday party at Boa. and City boy Jordy. City boy Jordy. Mm -hmm. um, and Tara's dad um, paid for our meal because mm -hmm. he's a great guy. We love he's him. Papa Pits. He's love a goat. Him. Yeah, guy. so he's... And we had a great dinner. It was a great he time. He listened to the podcast, too. Yeah, he listens to the podcast. <laughs> yeah. Shout out to him. He's listening in. Um... And yeah, this girl just wanted to make sure everyone knew that. How many times did she say? At least twenty. His yeah. full name paid for this. He w he was getting embarrassed. <laughs> yeah, like, he, he was apologized like, to us. He was like, no, "Sorry about wait, this, guys. Man. Sorry about her." <laughs> We're like, "No, get dude, your Venmo we... out right yeah. now." <laughs> Everybody Venmo Jim Harris. That was just ridiculous. And like like they said, twenty times, just like on repeat. And let's not forget who paid for this. <laughs> Jim Harris. <laughs> that was pretty on point. I know. I will say right after, like, right as we were leaving, she, like, fell on the ground. Yeah, she was. Fell on the ground. Yeah. yeah. Like, she, was she was just walking trash. out and then, like, just, like, fell. In Boa. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Luckily, it was still in the in the room. The, the little. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. yeah. The little back room. Yeah. Boa, like, there was a point in time where I almost threw up in my, I literally threw up in my mouth um, because. <laughs> Dude, you do that. Yeah, a lot at restaurants. I know. I don't Dude. know. I I take big sips and then I cough and like, 
gets bad down here. <laughs> and so, but it was because of our manager, Zach. <laughs> Steve he, Harvey? Yeah. He oh, goes. No, Steve was there. <laughs> <laughs> he goes Steve to the bathroom <laughs> and he comes back and he's like, yo, Steve Harvey's here. And we were like, no way. So me and Nash were like, damn, we want to go see if Steve. He's like right by the bathroom when you go to walk in. So we get up, we walk out, we literally look at the table. I can see from. 30 feet away, it is not Steve Harvey. <laughs> and Boa's lighting is really dim, too. Like <laughs> We were in so, a little, like, back room with, like, a door. Literally, right as he opens the door, he looks over. He's like, yeah, that is not him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so me and Ash just still go to the bathroom and fucking come back. And I was like, we're just going to tell Zach that that definitely was Steve Harvey. <laughs> <laughs> so, so we go back and, like, we're telling him, we're like, dude, you were right. Like, that's Steve Harvey. And I go to take a sip of my water. And he goes, I fucking knew it. And I, like, to me, it was so funny because, like, it was obviously not Steve Harvey. What killed me is I told him I got a picture with him and, like, he didn't ever ask, ask to see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he was like, for real? You guys, like, that's actually him? I was like, yeah, I literally got a picture with him. And he oh never, he was like, no God, way, I knew bro. it. He was considering <laughs> getting up and going asking for a picture, too. Like, if we didn't say, like, no, you're show we were just like, no, bro, that was not Steve Harvey. But, yeah, almost threw up my water at the table. It was bad. Dude, I got I to gotta tell that one from the Italian restaurant that we were oh, at. Oh, shit. Literally one of the first nights we went out to eat with Zach. Do you remember that? They were like, we're going to do bottomless uh, drinks, and, like, you oh. guys can't handle it. Everyone leaves Bacari? yakking. Bacari? Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, literally, Sean's walking to the bathroom. I'm going with him to make sure he's good. Full on. Bathrooms are full full-on puke in the mouth starting to like, score out and i'm like no hold it hold it like lit it dude, oh yeah, my yeah. gosh yeah i remember <laughs> this like, this is right in front of the kitchen too like waiting for the bathroom oh, i'm banging on the door gosh. this lady comes out and she's like what and i'm like dude he's gotta go and she like gets out of the way he runs in there just oh like it was yeah. like dude because more kept coming up so we're like little it was bits, yeah it was, like, it was oh literally like a, dude, dude. Like, oh, dude. Were you just drunk what was it hammered it was the, uh, it was the, that was the funniest thing because they were like we were like yeah oh shit what's up someone's calling me oh um but we were like yeah like we're gonna do the bottomless drinks and he was like all right you guys sure like yeah. everyone that does those bottomless drinks leaves here throwing up and we were like dude we're good bro like, yeah <laughs> literally an hour and a half later uh, i remember i was walking away we like, from the restaurant yeah. like yakking just in, in like the bushes or something. And you were hitchhiking. Yeah, you we were trying That's, to catch a ride. That used to be Nash's thing whenever he, we got <laughs> drunk. Like he would literally just go out in the road and fucking he hitchhikes. <laughs> Remember when <laughs> you? he was doing Hulk Hogan impersonations? That was my. <laughs> honestly, I think I was used you to. You started that on the first night you're here, bro. We're fucking oh, blackout. Yeah. Oh my God. And yeah, you're, you're stopping traffic. <laughs> that, I was like, dude, you got it. was pretty funny. It right? was funny, but it was like, we're not going to do this. Then one was like the neighborhood police or whatever. Oh, yeah, he was like, security guard. He was like, oh, whoop your ass right now. I did that first night I met you guys. Yep. Yeah. Really? Holy shit. Yeah, uh, that's why I was yeah. like, this guy's got to relax. <laughs> <laughs> New from the jump. I mean, we do, we do have some good uh, some good news to talk about. We yeah. released our merch. Wow, the merch is out. Yeah. It's almost gone, too. Kind yeah, of. we sold out. Dude, we we sold out the shirts. We no, not some. yet. We, we still got nine shirts left. Okay. Oh, right, should we tell the numbers? <laughs> All right, don't mind well. shirts. Yeah, might as well. Sure. I mean, we got some hoodies left. We're now. never dropping these again, so the shirts for sure. No, it's good. We really haven't even we haven't even put a TikTok out about the merch. Yeah, you're right. We can promote think about it. it. Yeah. 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 No, we're good. Um, we're good. We're good. <laughs> we're yeah. all just like, and here we go. We're good. We're good. Right? We're good. We're good. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're fine. All right, now go buy our merch, please. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's please. good stuff. But it is good. I'm honestly everyone. Everyone. I wear it all the time, one. And two, everyone that gets it or sees it, they're like, yeah, y'all's merch is dope. Like, yeah. Even, yeah. even like other creators and stuff. Yeah. Though. They yeah. ask for them. I've gotten yeah. two compliments from strangers wow. wearing a hustle t shirt. I there was there go. for one of them at CVS. Wow. Mm -hmm. wow. <laughs> yeah. Should have taken it off and given it to them. Bro, I don't got anything <laughs> on underneath. Uh, <laughs> shirtless the rest of the day. <laughs> I do it, for, do it for the fans. Yeah. You're right. So, so that, was, next time. that was Thursday <laughs> that we dropped our merch. Mm -hmm. And that night, me and um, Tuck went to Poppy. Yep. It was uh, both our first times, I think. Have I been Yeah, that, that was definitely... I've yeah. never been to any of the clubs out here. Like, yeah. Any of, the any of them? Not a few. Dude, ex no vacancy and, like... Clifton's? 
Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. yeah Dude, yeah. Clifton's <laughs> is goaded, bro. I'm telling you, <laughs> I've yet no. to. What? It's probably you. Hide Nightingale. Hide? Never been. Wow. No, you've been in Nightingale, bro. You've Which been one's that? LP. Is that considered? Did, did you come with us when we went and we saw James Harden? I know you were no, in there. I wasn't. Dude. Dude, I, I we went to Nightingale James like Harden. Was it the only time? Bro, we yes. went out like once, once. When all of our friends came from Atlanta, me it and was Parker's around friends. my birthday. You came to like three or four of this the nights like we went out. At this point. One of the nights a was a year and a half ago. Sheesh, one of the nights is we went to Poppy. One of the nights is we went to like Nightingale. One of the nights we went to. You definitely came to Bungalow. You've been to a lot of clubs here, dude. That's, <laughs> where, dude. that's where I've I never go. been to a club. You've been to Bungalow too. That's where yeah. I. Yeah, we get. We should go there. This Bungalow is fun, club, but, but that, it's yeah, fun. that's like a daytime. Music thing. sucks, bro. <laughs> oh. No, really? I mean it's a sick, like it's a great spot crazy vibe but like i was literally i asked the dj 10 times to play like just like you said who got ox <laughs> are, are you an ox bro <laughs> but like any rap song they he said no top 40 songs yeah like, really not really, even really. it wasn't even like a rap thing that might have been one guy though we can't put that on bungalow no i think it was literally their rule i, really? I asked him i was like bro just like one song bro i, I was asking him for like 10 minutes <laughs> and it got to the point where like i was so pissed that i was listening to music through my phone. <laughs> I was like, this yeah, guy's just <laughs> drunk in the corner, pissed off. Like, fuck this guy's music. <laughs> it sucked, bro. Dude, talk. Do you remember at, what happened at Poppy, though, with that guy? And I always tell the boys, I don't know what it is about me. Maybe I have a punchable oh. face. Oh, my God. But yeah. I get singled out so bad. I don't know why. And all I, the time, dude. There's all literally the time. been people drive by and they're like, like there's, screw you. The, and like, who the, are first, you? the first time Sean ever told us this, that he, like, gets called out we're walking down hollywood boulevard he's got a smoothie in his hand and then this one guy drives by and he's like you in the pink hoodie fuck you <laughs> literally, literally for nothing dude for and he's like he's like no told you. And Josh is like, <laughs> what did i do That's, it's like that one tiktok of the the driver that pulls up to that guy and he's like hey you fat piece of shit oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Driving David sucks. that was david dobrik was it yeah. really yeah. yeah nick whatever oh, oh my god that's crazy he's like i'm not even driving <laughs> I know. What did I do, <laughs> dude? I just don't know what it is. Like, it's just. But okay, I'll, you want me to tell it? Go ahead. All right. So there's this guy. We're waiting for the Uber. This guy comes up and they're like, "Hey, man, you're lucky. Like, you're lucky. I'm chill now. Like, you were talking so much shit." And Sean's like, "Who are you, bro?" <laughs> and this guy's like, "Man, you're lucky. I'm gonna let you slide tonight." And then Sean's like, "What did I do?" And he's like, "Bro, I'm good with faces. I I know it was you, man." And Sean's like, "If you're good with faces, you would know it was not me." <laughs> <laughs> and then this guy was just trying to fight him. And everyone's like, yo, calm down, bro. And just cause. Yeah, just cause. He wanted to. What'd yeah, you do to this guy, man? Dude, <laughs> I didn't do anything. Like, I really he had, had me no question. Idea. I was like, damn, what's Sean doing? Something? <laughs> Dude, I just don't know what it is about. I, sometimes I ask for it. Sometimes I do stupid shit. But there are times where, for no reason, people just want to kick my ass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, Tempe. No, there was. I just said, I just <laughs> said there was definitely reasons. Like, Sometimes. all right. Well, I will say, out of all the events, the Saturday one might have been the best. Oh yeah, the most recent. Yeah, that one was definitely the most fun. Oh yeah, is that that's, what was that? That's what they need to all be. I don't. I don't really downtown know. rooftop thing. Yeah, yeah, it was like a little penthouse. Yeah. Oh like, yeah. Venue. I was saying if we could go to that a party like night. that. No, no. Once was, a week. Was last night was Sunday night. Yeah. Didn't y'all go last night to that? No. Oh, yeah, you know, we ate at your mom's. Yeah. But no, 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 Saturday, yeah, Parker sat this one out. I feel like you sit out, and it's always the best. Dude, <laughs> this is the first time I've sat out, and y'all have gotten in, dude. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm telling you. Hmm. I usually scope them out pretty good, but not this one. We got invited <laughs> no, to this yeah, one. Yeah, this one, yeah. I it. No, yeah, this well, one was, uh, we were on the I list. I made some good music, though, so it was all good. Dude, yeah, this, all right, so this one was a penthouse, downtown LA, literally had the craziest view. Mm-hmm. No line to get in. Pretty, really good open security. Open bar. Open bar, yeah, dude. This <laughs> Not only open bar, bro, they were pouring, like, you ask for a shot, they'd give you four. Yeah, yep. literally. And in one cup. <laughs> like, the, and I was like, I can't do this right now, bro. Like, it was getting towards the end of the night, they gave me a shot, and I, I looked at it, I was like, no way. <laughs> no chance. Dude, and I one want, of them did give me a jalapeno shot. Those mm. sucked, bro. Yeah, dude, what was with those drinks? <laughs> <laughs> bro, I went, I went to get my first one, and the bartender's like, 
do you trust me? And I'm oh, like, yeah, <laughs> not really. Wow. Wow. Well, I, don't know you. I, mean, like, you? I was like, okay, yeah, I guess. And then he made me the <laughs> spiciest drink ever, oh. bro. My mouth is on fire. What I was oh. wondering is like, yeah, like we went to the event. We had a great time and we're, we're literally talking about it right now. But I have no idea who sponsored it and yeah. how they make money. It's a write off. Part, yeah, that was Parker's theory. It was less about let's make money off this event. It was more like let's have a let's cool celebrate. Event. I met this chi- chick that worked for one of the, co- the company. Sorry. Um, <laughs> she sucked. That's all I'm going to say about that. <laughs> <laughs> she sucked? <laughs> Dang. Bro, Dude, oh, she, I remember she, the story. Yeah, yeah. Sean, like, was joking with this one girl in line, like, and she was like, oh, you cut me. Like, uh, she was completely kidding. Uh, and then, like, I went up to Sean and to say, like, yo, just give me, like, whatever you're getting. Yeah. And then this girl grabs me, and she's like, you cut her. I'm like, what are you oh talking about? God. And then I just kind of went along for a second. I was like, oh, yeah, sorry. Like, I'll, I'll back up. Like, it's all good. And then she just, like, wouldn't shut up about it. So I was like, all right, well, first off, like, she Isn't was this an open bar. That. And, <laughs> and I, was like, I was like, first off, she <clears throat> was joking. And second off, she was talking to him. And she was like, oh, well, thanks for putting up with my bullshit. And then I just went. And then he decked her in the face. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just, I walked away. I was like, I'm not talking to this girl. Like, she sucks. Did you yeah. did you see the donuts? <coughs> yeah, I didn't eat them though. I don't uh, know. I, dude, donuts? And yeah, they, they had, had donuts. free weed and we fucking we didn't, didn't get any. It. Yeah, we didn't get yeah, any. Yeah, I was pretty mad about weed. that, honestly. That's some that's sometimes like we don't go to a lot of events, but the ones where they ha- well, we do go to a lot of events. <laughs> I'm saying we we <laughs> don't go to a lot of we events. Go, we just named like four events. No, we week. don't go to a lot of events that give out free weed. Oh yeah, yeah. But, and, but they when, rarely do. But when, like the ones that do, those are the best. Like yeah. that, the one at Wish was sick just because like they were just rolling. Bro, they loaded us up even at yeah. the end. They were just giving yeah. us handfuls. Yeah, I'm pretty like, sure we got like a cup of weed, like of like a few a cups. Quart, yeah, bro, we got at least. I mean. I don't even want to say it because <laughs> drugs. <laughs> <laughs> but, but yeah, uh, those are the best. But we blew it on yeah, this one and yeah. didn't get no, anything. But either way, that event was sick. Yeah, yeah. we left a good super night. sloppy, bro. Oh, Carson oh my banged God. his shin on the freaking trailer, bro. He was yeah, trying to throw. Pitch. He was trying to throw Yomi a pass with a water bottle. Yeah, a post <laughs> and you know when you like do something, you know something bad's about to happen. Because like I threw it and it went straight to the left over towards like all the cars. And I was like, <laughs> no, no, no. I think it went um, right over. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was, I was, I was, and so I was like, no, no, no. Like, I turned around and was, like, jumping, and I jumped right into a car. Oh, damn. But it was, like, a van and had some trailer hitch on it, and I oh, man. kind of messed I've up my leg. Before that. Dude, that shit hurts. I just did that the other week at No Vacancy, and I totally ripped off of someone's bumper. I put it back on, <laughs> oh, though. Yeah, dude. I, I would pay to on. see that video, bro. <laughs> Dude. But yeah, I, uh, Couple I, don't know, nights. I don't know how, but it, like the bumper like got stuck on my pants, and I, I tripped and <laughs> ripped that fucker off. <laughs> wait, I wait, don't... wait! You tripped and ripped. <laughs> <laughs> ripped and tripped. Yeah. Oh, you gotta love it. No, it's good stuff. Uh, <laughs> let's let's. I mean, we had a good night last night. Yeah, celebrating Jordy's birthday again mm-hmm. at the G Bros. Mom's. Mom and Gino. Yep. We don't. Uh, shout out to her. It was yeah. a great meal. Uh, it was a good time. She made and spaghetti and pasta. Balls. Yeah, dude, she makes the best food. Love you, mom. <laughs> yeah, but um, one positive thing this week, one negative. Let's just to wrap things up on the. Oh, like personally for everybody? Yeah. Okay. Or, I mean, maybe just let's go as a group. We don't need to all go around. What do you? I think we should. <laughs> should we? I think so. All right. One positive thing for me this week. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know really. Come on. Like, just in general, I mean, yeah. maybe the the good, that wasn't this week. Since we last came here, positive thing, the good response we got on this podcast, that wasn't this week, week before, especially on the first episode. It's yeah, nice that, 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 nice nice. that uh, people can find joy in my failures. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, but it's good. And one negative this week, we missed out on the free weed. Yeah. Mm. Mm. That's mine. Okay. Doc. Okay. Uh, positive. I like that TikTok I made yesterday with all y'all's reactions. Mm. It was pretty good. I'm thinking maybe I'll do a couple of those, like different ones. Yeah, but that's nice. just like saying different things. Compliment? Yeah, dude. Yeah, I like Spe- that. <clears throat> I like a little that. positivity. Um, the negative. Dang. I guess when I fell down the stairs, that kind of hurt. Oh, man. <laughs> you were drunk, bro. <laughs> 
Tucker fell down a Saturday, solid yeah. like four or five stairs. Like. And then I just slid all the way to the door almost. <laughs> yeah, wow. and then he yeah. spent the rest in the toilet a little bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> a little shower. Everyone's loving session. the shower now. If you're ever too drunk in our house, get in the shower, you're in the shower. Bro. It's the move. Dude, it is. It's the water like, never gets cold. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> For hours. Oh, I'm, my. Yeah, the water heater on that in this house has got to be freaking... I don't even know how big they're supposed to be, but <laughs> before we went out, I fell asleep in the shower for like a couple. Before? Or, yeah, I don't know how long. Just a little nap, you know. And then I made it out. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Careful with that, Karsh. You got a high low. What, dude? Um, it's shower. Negative. Positive. Probably seeing my mom. It's been um, about a month. About yeah. a month since Damn, I seen him. He's, sne- it. he's sneaking Damn. in those. He's sneaking in those brownie points. Really yeah. Big. <laughs> um, the truth, man. Negative would probably be. Hit my leg on that car. Mm. Mm. So Rough. injuries. Really yeah. Bad. Damn. Yeah, Let's go, Sean. Definitely. What you got? <laughs> yeah. No positive. No positive, positive was definitely yesterday getting like noticed in at Melrose, like getting a lot of love from the from the fans and supporters. Like that was sick. Negative was probably our second event. Oh mm. yeah, you were pissed about that. You were probably the most mad out of everyone. I was, was fuming bad. in the club. I was, like, people were coming up to me and, like, yo, are you good? Because I was fuming, dude. Like, I, like, I was so mad. Like, it's just, it's just I don't even want to get it started again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dude, you had, yeah. you had the most amount of reasons to be mad. Yeah. yeah. You, yeah. All right, yeah. Parker, high low. Uh, my high is I'm about to have this music all the way together. Hell yeah. In the studio oh, with yeah. Red. And... Reddington? Doesn't know. <laughs> no, just <laughs> And, um... Low is probably either the event or just views being down bad right now. Mm. Past right. past week or two. It's tough. Mm-hmm. It's tough. That's probably my low. Yeah. Like consistent low. There's yeah. some other lows. That's, it's been yeah. tough out here. For yeah. sure. Yeah. I mean, I mean, it, literally the next thing we got on here, it says, are we sellouts? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I, I mean, guess we're straight man. into that, bro. Are we? That's part of the reason our our content's not doing too hot because we are added up right now, bro. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ask us to post every day. Yeah, yeah. It's also, and I feel like it hurts our morale here in everyday post, even if it's not, not even that. And I mean, we had to change our name. Like people don't yeah. think we're a house anymore, which we definitely are. Yeah, it's confusing our fans, our people. We were there was a solid like five days where we were just like losing followers on TikTok. Yeah, that's yeah. never that's never happened literally to us. First time since we started. I yeah. mean, no, it's literally never. I mean, it's never happened. We've never gone negative, even mm-hmm. like from the second we started. We've only been going up mm-hmm. on the yeah. followers every day, and like we well, we had a video do good last night. Yeah, and we're back. Mm-hmm. We're I back. I personally don't think we're sellouts. I just think it was an opportunity that we wanted to try and see if it was good for us. We, yeah, but we all sat around at the end of the day and said we would be stupid not to move into this place. Yeah. Because it was great. And honestly, originally, what we thought, what the setup was, was a very good setup. Yeah. <laughs> but it's changed a little bit. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. yeah. yeah it's, no. it's, it's a great just opportunity been, that's cha- that has turned into something else. Yeah. It's just been difficult to stay on top of our, like, the content that we want to be our putting out. Stuff. Yeah. Because they're so we've, on the, our ass. The, I mean, yeah. we've been able to... We've met a lot of people in this house, too. I think our network's uh, expanded a lot just because we... It's a place that... We throw the events. That yeah. and, like, yeah, we can have people over pretty much. And, like, we never invite people over to, like, some of our last places. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, but, and, and, like, we've just, like, living with other creators. Like, some people have been in and out. But, like, their um, network has also, like, been brought into ours. So it's... Yeah, yeah. and they're mm-hmm. cool-ass people. Well, yeah, <laughs> we've know, met some like, dope-ass friends along the way. So some real been, friends out here. So yeah. It's dope. Yeah, so it's been, it's been good, but yeah, we need to. I feel like we just need to get back on our, yeah, on our on our game. I wouldn't say that we're sellouts. Just I don't know. There's a difference between like what we're doing and being a sellout. Like I feel like we experimented and mm-hmm. wanted to try something, yeah. and we obviously hate it. Like how we're talking about yeah. it. So I don't yeah. think you can be a sellout with like a month and a half agreement. Yeah, like, that's not much of a. You're right. So like, I feel like if we were doing we, more ads for like different brands on top of it, we would look like even more of sellouts. Yeah, that's what we've been doing, and dude. I, that's why our views are down bad. That's yeah. So 
when you when you already have a posting schedule for someone that you have to do, uh, I can't. I'm not gonna drop yeah, how yeah, many yeah. times and yeah, stuff. Yeah. But like we have a certain amount of videos that we have to put you out. Gotta, you gotta stop banging on the table. Oh my bad. <laughs> <laughs> we have a certain amount of requirements, and so when you have that on top of like when you're trying to make money through brand deals, it's kind of hard because then we're dropping four five fucking ads a week yeah and it does seem like we're sellouts that's something we didn't think about yeah yeah we wanted to we wanted to save money but we didn't think we're going to be doubled up on the ads because we're going to have our ads that we need to run to make money and then yeah ads through Mm -hmm. so i mean you live you learn you know we're we're not perfect out here at all we're Mm -hmm. probably far from furthest out here but we're going to figure it out we're going to it definitely hasn't changed us though it's just changed no yeah and i don't want what we've learned yeah, yeah, people might like. We've even had people ask us, "Are y'all still a house?" Whatever. 100%. All of our fans, we're definitely still a house. We're definitely still sticking to our original plan. We just maybe made. I don't know. Wrong, I wouldn't say it's, it's. I wouldn't say it's the worst <laughs> though. Like I said, yeah. Think about some of the people that we've met and just like the friends that we've. Like it's been a good summer so far. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. No. No. Yeah. For sure. So I mean, pros and cons. Yeah. Always, we'll weigh them. All right, let's get into let's get into our next segment. Underrated or overrated? These are things. These are things in LA that we experience that people probably hear about and want to know our <coughs> opinion on, maybe. So, all right, first one. In and out. Overrated. Overrated. Bro, In and Out's the most overrated. The burgers good. Fast food restaurant of all time. I've gotten <clears throat> to a point. You think it's the exclusivity? I rather Being only. Rate. I literally rather McDonald's. I was literally about You're to say that. Kidding, Whoa. bro. I know that's a statement. I like, was gonna say f- like Five Guys, but oh, Five Guys beats oh, all. Yeah, yeah Five, five guys, guys for is sure. Yeah, yeah, for sure. But but M- In-N-Out? McDonald's Dude, burgers In-N-Out, like bro. the, the In and Out burger, good. The fries, cardboard. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Just get milkshakes. The only thing good there. Milkshakes suck. Yeah. Dude, no, yeah. not to mention you want to wait an hour for fucking. <laughs> I gotta relax a little bit. <laughs> but you want to wait an hour for, like, trash? Dude, the Cardboard? burger is good, bro. The burger's decent. The burger's better than the McDonald's burger, but I'm going to McDonald's over In and Out. Yeah. Oh, wow. Cars, what are you going with? I'm going to go, it's overrated. Wow. Okay. All right. Next one Saddle Ranch. I think it's rated pretty, pretty, pretty accurately. even, pretty accurately. Even, but yeah, it's a, <laughs> it's dude. I I like it. I, I do think too. it's a good um, experience every time we go. Yeah, we just uh, sometimes we go after the pod, early on in the podcast uh, filming when we were you know still testing yeah. the waters, we got way too drunk because we were like, <laughs> yeah, we got to bring the vibes to the podcast. Like, let's get hammered. So we got drunk. The podcast sucked. That's why we didn't release it, obviously. Sean was slurring his words, like, half asleep on the couch. (laughs) And then after it, we literally go straight to Saddle, and they open at 4. We, like, finished filming at 4. And we're walking up with red Solo cups, like, literally, like, and they're like, put the cups away. Parker's like, can I finish it? Can I finish it? (laughs) Everyone's like, can I finish it? They say, you guys aren't coming in here. We've been beefing with them ever since. They lied to us about the gift cards they gave us. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We haven't Jeff. been in a while. Yeah. Yeah. We had like like a month, over a month. At least. We we had two reservations and we just canceled them the day of. Yep. But I think it's e- evenly rated. I, I would say fair, fairly rated. We've had great times there. If you go there, if you haven't been there and you want to go there, it's go there to maybe see people mm-hmm. and enjoy the vibes of it. Don't go there for like if you want to enjoy a good meal. No, <laughs> it's more of like really cool drinks. Are you saying it's, like, no, so. dude? Their food is gas, bro. <coughs> but it's like bar food. Mm. The appetizers they do load you up, bro. Bro, what is not have, good? It's true. I can't think. I of will one say thing. I like the ribs. The dude, ribs what are the do you, only thing I, I want to know what you don't like. I don't really eat when I go there. <laughs> you don't really eat in general. <laughs> <laughs> I just know that the food. Like I feel like I've heard it, and I feel like what? you guys. It's, it's, it's bar food. Okay, it's good bar yeah, food. we get like the nachos, onion rings, and stuff like that every sliders. time. Sliders, sliders, yeah. yeah the, dude, it's all good though. It's all solid. Quesadillas, and all right, it's, the nachos, and it's good portions too. Never mind, go mm-hmm. there for the food. No, it's just like it's a little, it's a little wild. I don't know, but it's, it's a fun <laughs> environment where you can get pretty, pretty litty and. Have Everybody's you have you driven exciting. past it though recently? Like they took the whole tent thing down. Oh, I saw that. Yeah, it's like oh, back dang. to probably how it used to be before COVID. I kind of like the tent. I though. do want to go there just to ride the bull. Are um, they doing that now? Yeah. Mm. Well, mm. I have to. 
Let's run it. Right in. All right, next. Next oh, one, uh, Boa Steakhouse. <sighs> I mean, it was a good time. Great Wait. time, like great atmosphere. Yeah. I just, I don't know, man. As a, <laughs> the, the prices the prices are up there for sure. I just, it's a steakhouse, and I, like, we got a steak, and I just. Dude, I got. Really? I, I was I over here thinking, cheese and... is Longhorns better? Wow. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Based yeah. on that, I'm going to say it's underrated. Over, you mean? Over. Under. Under? Oh, you I disagree with the Longhorns comment. I, I like Boa. I've been there a handful of times. I I just think it kills me when you like order, like, we got salmon and a steak, and they bring out the plate, and it's just Dude, the, the steak. salmon just, was yeah. a joke. The presentation like, was There's no, like, nothing else with it. Just, like, it's a white plate, just steak. Like, mm -hmm. and you're paying 50 bucks. And it's just mm. like, come on, throw some asparagus on there. Maybe some, maybe mashed yeah, potato. Yeah. Maybe just something. A little side like, of something. Or just decorate the plate a little bit. Like yeah. Some, put a flower on there. It just something. looks like, it looks like <laughs> we something. made, it looks like we <laughs> made a steak at home and like all we, we look, had hey, was the nice plates. And hey, we just we like. bougie as broke boys out there. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fact. <laughs> we're coming at Boa right now. <laughs> no, we're not coming at him, bro. It's a little just, bit. Get if they the got pre the presentation up, <laughs> I wouldn't be having to say anything. Dude, it's it's a good time though. Like the vibes no, the good. vibes were great, great yeah. like atmosphere, good yeah. good service. Yeah, yeah. Good service. the mac and cheese that uh, shit's gas. Oh no, yeah, with the lobster, yeah, that mm -hmm. was gas. Mm -hmm. The wine was great too. Cars, what are you going? Maybe with? Maybe it was just under. a steak. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go overrated. Mm. Wow. Okay. Am I the only Me one that said under? Yep. Wow. I, I'm gonna, I'll go under as well. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. The salmon was the best. I, I didn't get a steak, but I actually it gets I did a lot of credit, it. so maybe it's just like accurate. Okay. So fairly rated. Wow. Fairly rated. All right. Influencer parties. Yep. Is that the next one? Yep. yep. Um, I'm going underrated. Underrated. Yeah. Way underrated. Yeah. I feel yeah. like people. People hate on them. But. Hate on influencers, and but like if you went to these parties, they're so sick. One, <laughs> like everything's free, like open bar, uh, open bar, free yeah. weed. It's always at a dope venue, like Dan B's old house or like the penthouse in like the downtown. You see the skyline, like you meet a bunch of new people. Everyone's always super cool. Mm -hmm. And yeah, and like, I feel like most people are like looking to meet people too. Yeah, yeah like everybody's sure. down to like talk to whoever, mm -hmm. and it's like a cool, yeah. a lot of pong played. Yeah, <laughs> they're dope for sure. Yeah. Underrated. Good time, yeah. What about what under. about just like influencer house parties? It depends. Depends the house. Okay. Mm -hmm. There's been some bullshit, Beaters. dude. The the one time we went to uh, Nige's, yeah, that one was lit. Lit. The south. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were a thousand bucks to dude, chase Claypool and some palm. Lace Che. I that say one's in the past for me. My though. favorite. <laughs> one of my favorites was. Um, Rylan throws good parties at his house. Oh yeah, sure. yeah, yeah. Mm. Dude, Dude, that one. I don't think I've been to Rylan's. I'll say that one sink party after we were yakking after Bakari. It was pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Outside of like us fighting people sink, and stuff. Yeah, but. sink throws some good ones. Yeah, I don't know. We threw some good ones, honestly. Season one. Yeah. We were throwing and some. And lately, we've thrown some good ones. Yeah. Just... Yeah, we've been getting a lot of complaints from the neighbors, and they're just like, "Yeah, we're not allowed to throw parties anymore." Yeah. We were pretty much. Our, uh, we were going in that first few our, weeks in Swimpley. Yeah, the the person that works for Swimpley that lives in the house, like, remember after our event when we it got shut down, we were, like, inviting everyone. We really weren't inviting everyone yeah. back. But, like, someone, I guess, heard we were leaving, so they were just, like, they're definitely going to throw a party. Like, Pull up. word started getting around, and, like, this dude's just blowing us up, like, no one come to the house. We're going to get evicted. Like, do you guys want to throw the house away? Literally, yeah. like, 20 texts in a row. I know. And then... I just kept saying, or not. Knew a lot of people weren't coming. Yeah. We knew that. We knew a lot of people. It was like, what, 15 people came over? Yeah, and the it end was, was like 20. Yeah. We mm -hmm. did, like, a lot of people, like, got denied before we got there, though. Before those other, like, 20 people got there later, and then we let in. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, there were, when we pulled up, there were, like, probably, like, I don't know, 20 people there. We didn't know those people, though. No, for sure, yeah, but yeah. I'm just saying, rent like people. Word was getting out. Yeah. yeah. Whoever wrote boner on our fucking car, fuck yeah. you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. People were like big boner all over my car because <laughs> you didn't get into our party. Are you bricked up or what? <laughs> Jeez. So our next segment is guys on girls, respectfully. So I put it out on my story for you guys to like send me questions that you guys might want to know. 
about us. And then we got some good ones for girls like asking for advice on what we would do in these situations. Mm -hmm. So the first one is, do guys check or care if a girl they like views their story, likes their picture, and comments on it? And this was sent in by Katie. Katie. Good question, I'm going to say, just right off the top, for me, 100%. I yeah. definitely, definitely notice. I think it's a yes all around. Okay. Dude, Are you you're getting, she's commenting, bro? Yeah. No, no, yeah, she was, I think she was you, just saying in general, like, any of uh, those, like, she views yeah, your story. story like, yeah. okay. I don't always pay attention I don't, to the story. I look I'm, for the, like, yeah, I'm not looking, I'm not looking for... That's the one that I just anything. I don't look well, at. Well, you guys but... also just have like so many. It's impossible. Oh, so yeah. many, bro. Yeah, so it's... Many. <laughs> I'm not saying it like that, but like it's <laughs> it's almost like it's annoying to like try to look for someone. Does it in organize there. it? Like, does it put it like the people you like, follow on top? Only like the first like 15. Like, yeah, just that's how mine is too. Mm. Wish you could change that. Yeah, that would be something. Yeah, I don't, I don't get that many, so it's pretty easy for me to navigate and see what's up. Okay, like. <laughs> the opposite of that, though, is it negatively affecting if they don't and you're looking for it? If you're, like, looking for a comment or a like and they well, don't? Well, it's negative to me, but, like, mm -hmm. she might be, uh, like, she might, it might make me think about it. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Yeah, dude, what are you doing Playing with games. sound on I'm right sorry, now? my bad. <laughs> are you on TikTok, bro? Oh, my mom's calling me, bro. Okay, my Dude, uh, you just ignored your mom's call? You should have answered okay, on the okay, pod. Dude, dude, I'm okay, playing, okay, I'm okay. <laughs> Hey, ma. Of course. What? You're quiet. Are you, are you looking for it or no? Yeah. Okay. All right. I look for the like, not the story views. It's, it's tough to read through this bar right here, bro. All right. Next one. All right. If a guy likes a girl and she posts a good picture or a good story, are you going to be swiping up on it? So this is like, I guess, the exact opposite of that one. This one was sent in by Annie. Hmm. Uh, see, I don't know. With that one, I'm it's I'm not just... doing a lot of swiping. Yeah. Mm, okay. I don't think I've... Uh, Swipe for links. Only like I do for music sometimes, but not like. No, not the links. Just like swipe on a story, swipe up on a story, and react. Yeah, like send a like a heart emoji or something. Oh, yeah, yeah you're thinking she, it's the say she, yes. <laughs> say she posts a banging pic and then she puts it on her story, and you see it. You're gonna swipe up on it and let her know. She's and looking like respond pretty much. Yeah, story. probably not. Probably not. That's what I think. I don't really respond. I don't think I've ever really. This this is a girl you like too. It's not just a random person yeah, that you see. Probably okay. not. Only girl I girls I do that with is like someone that you've just kind of been like hooking up with a little bit. Okay. And like okay. you're not really. It's not. It's not as much as like a crush thing. It's kind of like hyping them up a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not really in the DMs a lot in general. Yeah. You're not. You're not a big DM guy. No. <laughs> nah. I'll be honest. I'll I'll do it. I'll swipe up on it. <clears throat> yeah, I'll I'll Why are you saying that? Like it's a. <laughs> what? Like, yeah. I'll admit it, man. I'll be yeah, honest. I do it. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's no shame in it. Yeah, it's cool. Sean, no, I don't really, I don't DM. Like that's not really my, that's okay. not my thing. You know, okay. I mean, I Even have if it's before. girl you're talking to. I yeah. have before. Is, are you, like, I'm not, uh, I'm not just saying be going and in, in the DMs. Like, no, no, I yeah, I'm saying yeah, I have before, and I. Like, I guess I agree kind of with, like, what Nash was saying. It has to be someone that I've already been, like, getting with. Like, mm. if it's just, like, yeah. it's me seeing that person, I'm not going to swipe up and, like, be like, damn. Okay. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> damn. <laughs> I just feel like that's what, like, like 40-year-old dudes on Instagram, like, trying to, like, do. You're trying to get to attention? Like, yeah. To, like, girls that they think are hot. They're just, like, oh, like let me buy you dinner or some shit, like shit like that. <laughs> it's just like i don't know that's just not how i'd want to go about it i just feel like it's a little creepy almost mm -hmm. only only not for everyone but like <coughs> yeah in no, some no, I hear you. <coughs> are you good barely they call you good here man <laughs> <laughs> all right the next one we got is what do you guys do if two of you are into the same girl um so, uh, <laughs> I think we box. No, we, no, we don't box. I mean, it's just kind of like bare knuckle. We're all on the same team, so it's just like, hey, go for, her, I'll go for, her, whatever. These two ha seem to have tendencies, though. These two being Sean and Tucker. <laughs> Not really. And we Not have really. in the past. That's in a the lie. past. What am I about to say then? What? That you two? Yeah. Are. What? I don't know. Girl Fill in the blank, brother. Um, y'all tend to like the same girls, sometimes. Not not a, not as of late, but like that's what I'm saying. In the past, but yeah. lately we've uh, we're in our own lanes. 
Yeah. Yeah. Big Do lane it. boys, huh? Yeah. <laughs> and Do I we, think I think there was it's some never in the past us, there's been some swerving. But wow, some Yeah, connecting. Sean was big time swerving, bro. I had to bump him out the lane. Well, I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> wow. How's it show? <laughs> but yeah, I think uh, right now, as recent, like we haven't had any issues. Yeah, we don't like really that. have girl problems within the house. Dang, that was sent in by Macy too. I don't know if I said that. Okay. You got any more segments? Yeah, we got one more. So biggest uh, biggest failure. This is like damn, something that we. It's what Dude, they love to hear. Yeah, though. you can learn it about real. it and like, yeah, all right, it's all real, right. bro. Well, are we talking about like ever in life or like maybe just one one that comes to head? Like when I was like, I was thinking about the next segment already, and I was like, one definitely popped in my head. Like it's all just right. like how recent is it? I mean, I uh, got one that's just I was just our our ex manager. Uh, okay, yeah, that's a good one. That's a this is a really good one. So, I mean, Sean, I don't even know if you know about this, but so the reason me and Carson moved out here was because of our last manager i'm not going to give her any promo not going to give any of them anything so me and carson uh we had built up a nice youtube channel like we were doing two videos a week and we got up to like 13k on youtube we had a good like fan base momentum. going yeah. good momentum and everything out of nowhere we were just like so we were promoting an email in our pages we hadn't gotten any brand deals at this point but we had a lot of people like a lot of attention on us so i was just <clears throat> trusting that she's doing her doing her job and i asked her if i could see the email and she goes freaks out calls us kids children don't know what we're doing takes our youtube channel logs us out like it was linked to her email her password yeah never and it was yeah got it back, bro. never crazy. got it back bro because google doesn't have like a customer service line you can call so it's like mm -hmm. it's like i can request like whatever but she's got her email her backup email so everything's just going to her like yeah. there's no shot I can get back. And even if Google had a thing, what are you gonna call them and say like, yo, this lady that has like the YouTube account stole it from me? They're yeah. Be like, did she? Yeah. Yeah. Straight up. Yeah. So my that's probably my biggest failure is just being way too trusting, moving out here for the first time, like doing this. So yeah, no, it's a good uh, good lesson to learn. Yeah. though. Dude, Dude, we're not the worst. Worst. Mine is way worse. <laughs> mine's, mine's, <laughs> oh. pretty, mine's pretty bad too. Okay. I mean, I probably have others. That was just the first one that well, popped no, in my head. No, it's still though. a good one. It's not, I'm not, it's yeah. still a good one. No, mine no, yeah, just, that's still, yeah. It's no stress. It's just mine's like, I yeah. don't know. Yeah. For sure. Um, should I, should I tell mine? Yeah, go ahead. Damn, we got a freaking crowd now, too. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, I'll tell uh, mine. What's going on It's all right. <laughs> I kind of, I kind of want to tell it, to be honest. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. No go one's ahead. ever, honestly, like, if my friends, some of my friends don't even know about this. Like, a lot of them. They kind of probably wonder what uh, what happened. I'm kind of sweating them to tell this story. <laughs> <laughs> Put it out oh, there on the internet. So a lot of you guys probably don't know. So I like I played soccer my whole life growing up. It was really the only thing I did. Like I mean, I played other sports, but like soccer was really my life. Every single weekend, I'm on the road. Like I don't get back till Sunday night. You know, le get checked out of school early on Friday. Don't get back till Sunday night. Every weekend, just playing games, whatever. Went to college. You know, got a scholarship, whatever. Really nice school. Rival of your school, obviously. Yeah. Wofford Tuss. Um, Yeah, pretty much, long story short, I got kicked off the team. So, like, I mean, if to get into it, like, failed a drug test, don't need to harp on. It wasn't, I'll just say it wasn't weed. Um, and, yeah, I got kicked off the team. That wasn't the only, like, thing that got me kicked off, but, like, it was just, like, a sequence of events. And it was really just, like... <laughs> That was like all I ever did. And like, that was like kind of what I was good at. I didn't really know at the time. I was just kind of like, fuck this. Like, but like looking back on it, like, especially trying to get good at something again, like photography and stuff, I was like, damn, like it takes, I didn't realize the work I had put in to like get to that point. And like for it to be taken away like that quick, like, yeah. like at the highest of my, like, it was like the biggest fall outside of like if I went pro and like ruined my career, like it was probably yeah. like the biggest fall I could have had. I almost sometimes wish like I fucked up earlier than that because like easier to recover. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But I mean, what's the biggest fail? Like, what's the def? Like, what's a failure? Because like brought you here, yeah. Like, I, I definitely wouldn't be here. Yeah. yeah like, sure. so I mean, I don't know. It is what it is. But yeah, that story probably not a lot of people have heard. A lot of my friends now, like you guys now. Yeah. Like a lot of my yeah. close friends, yeah. but like, yeah, people don't know that. So, yeah, this was brought me here. Definitely my biggest failure. Harps on me a lot. Like. Mm. There was like years after that, like I was beating myself up about it, like for a long time. Like people always told me, like 
oh, you got to do this, you got to do that, like, to, like, bounce back from this. But, like, no one ever was like, you got to forgive yourself. And yeah. that was, like, the biggest thing for me, really, was just, like, forgiving myself. Yeah. Mm. So. Well, I guess me and Nash kind of, like, uh, bonded first month because mm -hmm. we kind of went through the same thing. Like, I got kicked out of college for selling weed. <laughs> like, that was, like, my thing. Like, I, for for years... Like, uh, when I lived in North Carolina, I don't know what it is, but weed has always just had this little hold on me where I, I guess when I started, I was making a little bit of some good cash. And then once you start and you realize like it's the trap, like, you realize you don't have to go to like a job and that you can smoke and that you can do this and make yeah. a lot of money. Make, I was making more money doing that than if I was working a job. So... I mean, for like an 18 year old, 18, 19. Mm -hmm. And so I guess my, yeah, my biggest <clears throat> failure is getting kicked out of college because even after that though, I have such a hard time learning <coughs> lessons. I have such a hard time. Like I can go through some bullshit and I will go back and sometimes do the same thing, um, which I needed to learn to like forgive myself. And that's why like moving out here and also starting social media has changed my life in so many ways because like I was so down bad when I was selling drugs like I just was depressed and I was just doing it just because I had no nothing else to do like yeah. I felt like I was just like you were saying trapped like I was just I moved out when I was 18 I was trying to do my own thing me and my me and my dad weren't getting along very well so I moved out and 18 moving out like when you don't have money and like I was just working at like Smoothie King so I just started selling weed and at the end of like at the end of the day like it never works out for you in your favor cuz I ended up getting caught with a lot going to jail. So this is my second episode of me being honest and saying I've been to jail. <laughs> so <laughs> but yeah. Yeah, like uh and I never want to go back. <laughs> like at least for like if for some, some some stupid stuff I don't like a little night in the drunk tanks not the worst yeah <laughs> but like never again for like what I was doing and you're on a better track now I think yeah, yeah for um, sure but yeah definitely biggest failures and I were those two right there and I just think I'm very happy where I am and I don't ever want to be back in that position I know I will never be back in that position just because and I'm glad like I went through it kind of at a young age yeah kind of like mm -hmm. i could have been younger could have made better life choices but i like nash was saying everything happens for a reason i think and for sure now i wouldn't be here with that without that shit happening to me either so yeah I don't mean, don't sell drugs kids yeah <laughs> you know don't do drugs either yeah i mean <laughs> clearly, clearly the, yeah. the big uh theme in this whole thing is drugs will get you in trouble it'll <laughs> yeah. it'll become your biggest failure so you know just skip that that lesson yeah yeah what do you mean i agree oh yeah yeah just yeah, learn, yeah, yeah. learn it learn it elsewhere yeah learn it from us we just told you yeah someone uh it was uh ross actually told me this my uh brother brother-in-law it was like i can't think of it it was like smart people learn from their mistakes but like wise people learn from like other people's mistakes so mm -hmm. they don't do them mm -hmm. ever that's pretty cool it's a good one yeah. Yeah. all right cars what you got um i just probably got to go along with yours the whole ex-manager thing dude what? you got something better than that dude i'm trying to think no, actually, too i don't know like, like, you don't moment. have anything better than that my bad me and you were over you're like yeah we know <laughs> i just don't I have like a defining yet. moment i don't think you haven't had it yet no 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 like i haven't had like anything like their stories like yeah, it's tough. don't say that, yet. You're not gonna. Yeah, yeah you're not going down. My bad. I didn't mean to say it. I know you got something better than that. Like, I hope you don't have any. Yeah, anything no. better than that. <laughs> yeah, no. She was a big reason that we moved out here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I I was thinking about it as well, like turning it into a positive thing. Like we probably would have kept doing our own thing if we had that For channel sure. still. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all all the failures lead back to yeah to this where we are now. Really. So I mean, what is a failure? You know, don't harp on it too much. It's a lesson. But yeah. uh. Also make smart choices, you know. That yeah. stuff was, I mean, we we also got a little lucky. I mean, not everyone. I, I got lucky, bro. I mean, like, there was literally just, like, I was friends with Parker, who was friends with you. Like, some so people. everything happens, though. It's no, just... but, I mean, people that made the same mistakes that I made maybe couldn't have, like, had the same type of opportunity. Yeah. So, 
feel that. Yeah. That's crazy. What about yeah. you? I don't really have like a defining failure moment. It doesn't even have, I just feel like after we said ours, it's just like so like. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of hard to, I just, don't really have like I went to jail. No, no, just put, uh, just go before, like we'll put yours before ours. Um, hmm. I don't know. Like, like, I don't feel like a failure now, but I feel like I haven't had a huge, like, one thing. As a fa- I mean, I failed in football, I guess. Went to high school, played at Furman, never saw the field for the one year I was there. And I always wanted to play college football, but, like, I don't really have a... Yeah, def- like... Like a defining, like, hey, there was a bunch of failure. My lowest point was probably when we were living in Atlanta pretty broke back then and uh just smoking <laughs> was, a lot of yeah. weed was, yeah not really doing shit but then again that's where i started getting into music so like yeah i mean every i feel like when you're always at your lowest you might like find you know some of your best work or whatever because you're like you're sitting there like damn like what am i gonna do like i gotta yeah. do yeah. something like yeah you know, that's yeah and then again like i haven't really felt like i've succeeded a lot yet so like, do I feel like a failure? Yeah. No, but have I succeeded? See, like, I, I don't. I knew you. I, I feel like I knew you were gonna say that a little bit, and like I feel the same. Like I think we just get so caught up in like the people that like we compare ourselves to, or like that we are competing with almost, or like we want to have the same success that they have. Like they're just like like we shouldn't be beating. Like we're twenty four. Like I'm twenty four. You're twenty five. Like. We're so young in the, and like those kids weren't like you played football your whole life. Like you, I was playing soccer. Like we were doing other stuff. Those, the people that we compare ourselves to, yeah, are on like chapter ten, yeah, and we're on like chapter three, mm-hmm. so or like four, whatever it is. Like that was just a little yeah, yeah, yeah. analogy, Analogia. but like we just I literally for the lot like. Cole Bennett, for example, like he's the reason like I literally even like got interested in videos. Like I saw his stuff and I was like, I want to like do stuff like that. And like for the longest time, I'll just like, like almost like envy like what he has or like what he's done. Yeah. But like I literally thought about it the other day. I was like, I envy him so much sometimes, but like he's literally the reason that like I'm even in this game. Yeah. So like, I don't know. It's just like, you just got to like appreciate what you have. And like, it's a journey. Like, Sometimes we all like we we want a destination so much, and like we almost don't like realize what we're like doing. What we're in the middle of mm-hmm. like I like memories looking back and stuff through life. Like just like I like I, I'm, those like, were great moments. Like, that was crazy. Like I need to like kind of just live in the moment more. You get so much caught up in the past and future. You just don't like. Yeah, it's that perfect balance of living in the moment enough, but not too much. You know, because mm-hmm. when you do it too much, you'll be on a on a two-week bender and be like where did we go how did nah, we get here especially <laughs> only with only with only with us yeah i That's swear true. a year ago i was literally working a roofing job like just moving in with uh gage and michaela like love you guys they're like my second parents <laughs> um because i really that was like where i was my living situation like they're my age they're married they're like a little older than me but married they were like my second parents like i said and I was trying to figure out something to do. And I had not, like, I was just like, I'm going to be living in Mooresville, North Carolina for the rest of my life. <laughs> like, <laughs> literally. So, that, like, yeah. I moved, like, just one just day. Just said it was like, Just one day. <laughs> for the rest of my life. <laughs> <laughs> one day I was like, I'm going to fucking make some videos on the internet. And I, I was like, I know I can blow up. Like, I know it. And I was like, and I know, like, I can... I saw people like Ryland living in the Hype House and saw like all this. That's kind of when like a year ago when TikTok was kind of like content houses were coming around Mm -hmm. like and I was like, damn, like look at all these people. I was looking at Bryce's shit and I was just like, I could be there. And then like a year has gone by and now we have a podcast like we hang out with Bryce. Ryland's one of my good friends and it's crazy. Like it feels like that happened in like a month span. Yeah. But it's been literally a year. I checked my memories. It's a year like yesterday That's when crazy. I was like live and I had like 50K and I was like dancing on, on live. <laughs> <laughs> like, and I was just like, I need to make it out there. I need to make some shit shake. Um, <laughs> like, 
Dude, yeah. Dude. I, I just graduated college and was back at home, and Carson literally, like, comes up. I was playing Fortnite. That was when it was hot. And he comes <laughs> upstairs. He's like, bro, we have to make TikToks, bro. I'm telling you, we can blow up. So, like, same conviction. Yeah. And then I told Parker, I was like, I guarantee this house will work. It's getting and there. And we ran it. It's getting there. <laughs> and we're, um... No, it's working. I mean, we've made it this far. I mean, it pays for our living. Mm-hmm. If we can, <laughs> <laughs> no, it does. We're not making a living. Look, we're paying. I mean, think of how great was our apartment though when we first moved out here? Like, would you rather, out of all of our places, nowhere else would rather be? Like, oh, would you? you no, no, <laughs> just out of all, like, would out of all of the places that we've stayed, would you take like any of? Would no. any of those you know go lower than is. You know us in the is. apartment? No. Even if it was our apartment just, was beat. Popcorn <laughs> roof. <laughs> well, what's popcorn the? Popcorn roof. Yeah, bro. we had the popcorn ceilings. Straight dust every cancer, morning. Straight cancer, dude. Yeah, we were we were dying in there, literally. Jeez. That stuff's got like good deal it, though. Iron or something. Good it? deal on rent for sure. <laughs> 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 Just your health is at cost. <laughs> Shit. Nah, we're we're good boys. All right, yeah, we're gonna end it on a positive note with one. Would you rather? And we'll all go around and give a little answer to it. Okay. Nash, hit us with it. All right. Uh, which one, are we doing that one? Yeah, let's do that one. All right. So it's would you rather. Like, live the bachelor life, the life kind of that we're living, like, not with a bunch of dudes, but, like, the life we're living now, just, like, single the whole time, yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, or. And never get married? Never, you can't ever get married. Okay. Yeah, or 18, you're married. For mm. your, like, and you guys stay together for. Bachelor life. Forever. Dude, forever. he didn't even think about it. No yeah, hesitation. So I don't have, yeah, I don't have to, like, 18, I, like. Hell no! I just the bachelor life takes out the whole kid factor. A that means bit. that means we would be married right now. No, yeah, it'd be, mm-hmm. be, yeah, and we wouldn't be doing this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. Probably take the bachelor life. I'd, yeah, yeah, definitely. Never get married <laughs> though, dude. But you can be dating, I guess. No, you're bachelor life. Yeah, no bro. dating. Damn. Yeah, dude. I might have to get married, boys. I think I'm. Parker's get, I think out I'm of here. getting married too. I just really want to have you, kids at some point. Yeah. Dude, I like want to have a great yeah, little I feel you have love a family, story, you know, yeah. good marriage. Yeah, I want damn. to have a family at some point. Yeah, I mean, damn. Is Uncle it going to be Sean a is it gonna be, come over, though? Is it going to be a great <laughs> marriage, or, like, what is it? <laughs> He's hammered. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, yeah, you, you guys are married your whole life. Like, the this is the one. Like, bro, 18. High school, high school sweetheart, sweetheart, bro. Like, you never even think So about. it has to be one of the, my exes already? No, No, it don't think of it like that. Okay, so I found the one. Yeah, you found the one. Yeah, dude, I'm getting married at 18. Cars? Yeah. I want to have a kids and, like, a family. Yep. Oh, yeah, that's a tough one. So John's um, the only We are all <clears throat> single right now. I was thinking about that the other day. We've all been single for eight months besides cars. Besides cars, yeah. 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 And kind of Nash. What? No, no, he was single the whole time. Mm-hmm. What? Yeah. <laughs> I was not. No, nah, yeah. <laughs> A little bit, but no. Yeah, you see what it's saying? It was just like, it was more like a talk. Nah. No. no. Honestly, if anything, would have, nah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, guys. All right, and that wraps another episode of The Good Boys. Um, you. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Go give us a little review on iTunes, Spotify, and we also got the visual on our YouTube channel at Hustle House LA. Yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, check it out. Give us a little, a little love. Yeah. If you're, if leave, you're liking it. Leave some comments. We'll answer them, you know, on the next one. <laughs> um, <Yeah>. Should we? <laughs> oh, and go follow the the Good Boys podcast on Insta. Yeah, hey, oh, on Instagram. Yeah. We're trying to get the followers up so we can just like ask, not post it on yeah. the other account. Yeah, yeah, we don't want to ask questions over. on on there, and like you guys can yeah. send us in questions and, like, and also, we interact with oh. you through there. Mm-hmm. And also go cop the merch. Yeah, please. Yeah. That's, yeah. Please go cop the merch. Yeah, let's get. <laughs> I think, hey, I'll tell you guys this: the quicker uh, we get rid of this merch, the faster we'll get some more, more stuff yeah. out. So, and we're yeah. not going to be dropping the same stuff. So, mm-hmm. ever. So, hopefully, this will become like a little collector's item, you know? Limited and edition. You yeah, got this it. first edition. I mean, we're not counting the last round. I don't. Yeah, think. dude. That no, was no, this was the first real drop. This is our first yeah. real drop. So get our first uh, right. round of merch. Longest rap ever. Oh, and that's that'll a good do rap. <laughs> and that'll do it. Love you guys. I'm part of Paul Hill. I'm Sean Shutt, 69. Carson Janal. Tucker Janal. Nash with the Flash. And we the Hustle House, baby. Love we you. Out. We love you. Peace. Peace.